Hello and welcome to There's Something in the Pipes, a short little point click uh, puzzle game developed by Falsely, available on Itch.io. And well, you need to take a shower, but the shower is full of blood. I guess we'll see what that means. And apparently this game is tagged as horror, but you know, it, 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 supposedly it's not that scary really, but just in case, you know. Uh, it may contain a bit of disturbing elements, so your discretion is advised. You know, I just give a content warning about. You know, I should I just give a content warning about life. You know, everything is disturbing. Life is disturbing, so your know, real discretion is advised just in general. No, <laughs> um. All right, so these are the controls. All right. That's a bit of a you know. How do you say, uh, one bit kind of art style to it as well? But apparently, there's something in the pipes. What could it be? I don't know. Four AM. That's really early. Well, either four AM or four PM. I'm not sure. Uh, I don't know why you would wake up four PM though. Unless you have like, I don't know, like a night shift. Well, we woke up. Wow, pretty good animation, by the way. Uh, Clarissa, I guess. What the hell? Oh, hello, Kako, by the way. Danny Boy, the pipes. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if that's, uh, uh, you know, what's going for me anyway. Um, what's wrong with the water? It's red and gooey and uh, smells terrible in here. That can't be blood, can it? Uh, okay, choose. Did I kill some- Did I accidentally murder someone? You know, did I murder someone and forgot about it? N no, don't be stupid, Clarissa. You know what you did last night. Six hours mining the store, an extra two hours past close, cleaning up after those brats. Then bed. There's no room for, for murderous blackouts in that timeline. I mean, who knows? Can you trust your memory? No, maybe not. Maybe I'll check the store security footage later, just in case. Hmm. Maybe, maybe it's just red. It can't be real blood. It just can't. So then, what is it? Maybe some kind of rust? Or fungus? I mean, rust... Well, iron in general does smell like blood, but... I don't know. I don't know, there'll be a lot of rust. I thought the council's checked the main sometime. Could be a build of a plant or dirt. Extremely red dirt. The pikes have been creaker than usual lately. Hmm. Did someone just die in here? Come to think of it, it's been one what, 18 hours since I was in here? Someone could have sneaked past me in that time. And died? In my bathroom. What am I even saying? <laughs> well who knows? Maybe maybe they just wanted a nice place to die. You would have noticed if your apartment was unlocked. You would have noticed the smell too. Besides, there's no body and one person couldn't bleed this much. And it's just a prank, bro. I'm just gonna bleed in your bathtub real quick. Um, maybe something went wrong elsewhere. Now, how many other stores are in, this pi are in this pipeline? Maybe someone dumped a liter of paint down their sink. Sure, there's a smell like paint. Click on this already, right? It can't be real blood. It can't be real blood. It just can't. So then, what is it? Okay, I already clicked on that. Anyway, so making sure. It's like there's different dialogue options, you know. You click on something multiple times, but uh, eh, screw it. I don't know. Whatever. Okay, standing around gawking doesn't change the fact that I need a shower. I can deal with blockage. I might have to skip breakfast, but huh? 
Who could it be at this hour? Hey, click on stuff. Cabinets. Something's ringing in there, apparently. But I'm lazy. I'm just gonna... Look at the bathtub. There's gotta be a smarter way to clear the drain than putting my hand in that. Who knows what kind of diseases I get. It's still a bit damp from last time I used it. I'll leave it hanging. Yoink! Get the broom. Right. No more excuses. I need to clean this up. Once I'm done fixing the shower, of course. My arm won't fit in there. Squeak. Nice and cold. Squeak. Okay. I don't know, I don't know why I was playing the sink. What's ringing, by the way? Why is there a ringing sound? Is in the cabinet? Okay, we, we put our phone in our bathroom cabinet. That's kind of weird to me, to be honest. I, I, I don't like putting electronics in the bathroom, usually. I mean, unless it's like, I don't know, like an electric toothbrush. It's made to be in a humid environment. Otherwise... Putting just a phone in here? What do you mean? It's weird. Uh, video 9. Clarissa speaking. Miss Dunce. Uh, Ingrid, it's 4 in the morning. Why are you awake? Oh. Uh, yeah, so... You said we're supposed to give, like, two hours notice we can't come in, right? That's true, yes. Awesome. Cause I got food poisoning real bad. Shitting everywhere! So I kinda can't open today. Sorry. You're lying to me. I'm lying to you. Let me guess. You forgot to study. Yeah, the exam is like eight hours. Right. Uh, go to sleep. How about you go to sleep? I have a store to run and a shower to fix, Ingrid. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Wait, what's wrong with your shower? I don't know. The tub's drain is clogged. And there's all this red liquid in it. Red? Blood red. So, did flushing the body down the toilet now work or... Ingrid. Get in. Jeez, but seriously, that's spooky. It's annoying is what it is. Maybe it's, uh... Don't. Uh... G -g 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 ghost! How about we blame Sadako after a plumber rules everything else out? Sadako? Uh, Sadako-san? A plumber before midday? Yeah, good luck with that. Hey, call me if anything weird happens, will you? I'm invested now. Plus, if I don't take a break every five minutes, I think my head will explode. I'll think about it. Good night, Ingrid. Uh, it would be nice to have someone my own age to call for advice, but I suppose Ingrid will do. Besides, if she held bent on pulling an all-nighter, I guess I can't make that any worse. You know, she never do a pull an all-nighter before an exam. I never do that. I have, however, pulled all-nighters to finish essays. <laughs> you know, <laughs> but like pulling all—I mean, just—I mean, it's just a science. You know, it's just like if you pull an all-nighter, like you, you you aren't gonna like remember everything. Cause that's how your brain works, you know. Because your hippocampus, you know, will remember things in short-term memory, but you won't remember things for long-term unless you rest, you know, you go to sleep, and then your brain processes the information that you've absorbed. So pulling an all-nighter just never works for exams. Never been a problem for me. I don't know, I'm weird. I'm like the, maybe not the opposite, but like for me, exams are easy because it's just, you just, you know, just read the material. You know, you just keep up with it, you know, you, you don't, you don't just like not, you know, do your homework. You just do your homework, you know, whatever you need to do or assignments or whatever. That's how you remember stuff. Um, but what I do hate those essays, I don't know, I'm, I'm, I'm weird because I, I don't like essays and I, I always put it off at the last minute. Like, I, I hate essays so much. I wrote so much essays in my university. I'm like so burnt out and like writing essays now. Um, I've always hated it for some reason. Exams though, usually easy. Exams don't require you to like do so much research and like, you know, look up so much stuff and find so many references to back up your arguments. And like, I mean, the hardest part is having a thesis, you know, having an opinion on something. That's the hardest part, you know, I don't know. Anyway, um, uh, with the water looking this disgusting, I think you're afraid to skip dental hygiene for now. Hmm. So no toothbrush, I guess. No, no uh, cleaning our teeth. Get the personalized essays. Yeah, I, I don't know. I that's actually worse. You know, maybe I'm just like an uncreative person, but like I don't like thinking of ideas. <laughs> you know, it's like I would rather just simply. You know, people always criticize this. To be honest, but like I rather simply just absorb the information and just vomit it back up. That's easy. 
for me anyway as long as i focus on it i i'm, I'm actually kind of bad of like just remembering facts but you know if i study it and then you know practice it then it's not so bad right especially multiple choice i love multiple choice because the multiple choice questions you know the qu the answer is right there you know you just look at it unless it's like a tricky one where like all oh, the answers kind of look the same but you know Otherwise, multiple choice questions are so easy because you it just you just read it and it's like, oh yeah, I read this before. Okay, this one, you know. I don't know. Uh, the way this morning is going, I won't be surprised if the light craps out on me too. Might as well have backup. Okay. Empty vitamins. There's nothing in there but uh, silica packets, and I'm not hungry enough to make that breakfast yet. You know, I remember actually. I read. A, I, I watched a video about someone. Eating a bunch of silica packets or whatever. It's not good for you, as it turns out. Uh, nine catalog. Let's take a look. Hmm, video nine. Okay. Apparently that's where we work. I'm assuming we're the manager of like a video nine store. Is it like a blockbuster? <laughs> Those don't exist anymore. Uh, has it literally been five years since I bought this place? What am I doing with myself? Caverns of Mysteria. I don't remember much about this movie. The one time it was on Free to Air, I fell asleep. Free to Air. 40 minutes later, I wake up to people screaming and a man falling upwards. Very disorienting. I wonder when, when this game takes place, actually. If he, it seems like it takes place um, in the 90s or 80s or something. I don't know. Because people still watch videos, you know, like not on YouTube. They like they rent like videotapes. That's what it seems like to me anyway. Uh, why didn't they use the Ouija board in this movie? I'm sure they must have been around in the 1920s. It would have solved a lot of problems if Lucille had thought to communicate that way instead of that strange symbol drawing system. But I guess they wouldn't have a plot if they did that. Three Walkman. I don't need to cut this coupon out. Not when I still have three block, uh, boxes of the bloody things. Hmm. I wonder if selling the access stock would count as fraud. Kid Zone. We don't even have a kid's zone in the store. It got too expensive to deep clean the puke in the slide. I'm sure if any families ever read these magazines, I never hear the end of the planes. Truck. I mean, I remember much about truck, but the soundtrack's frustratingly catchy. How they made a rap song out of the green sleeves, I'll never understand. Has it only really been 20 years since I snuck in to watch this? No time flies. Can't believe that amputation scene gave me nightmares. The veins are so obviously made of yarn. I don't know how old these magazines are, though, actually. Assuming that, but I'm assuming, you know, we're like, again, in the 90s, but maybe we're not. I don't know. Also, half empty deodorant. Having that ever growing mental list of things to throw out. Also, cool ranch? Come on, little guy, you've been in the closet too long. I take the rebel duck with me. Apparently, we're not going to brush our teeth, but was the sink working, actually? Hmm, it's going to be steamy in here. Ouch, yeah, that's hot. I mean, it looks like the it's normal water. The shower is, you know, water is like... Um, all bloody and whatnot, but it doesn't look like the sink water. But yeah, I don't know, I'm not sure. Look in the mirror. I should use the hand of the voice smudging the glass. Uh, camel drain cleaner? All feels quite light, but it's worth a shot. Bando bandages. If I move them from the shelf, forget where I put them, buy another box for no reason. They can stay where they are. Panadol. Canadol? How many is left in there? Three? I should save these for my headache gets worse. Okay, it's like Advil. Array of mostly full conditioner bottles. Does conditioner expire? Hmm. Question for my showers and bleeding, perhaps. Light switch. Oop. Now it's dark. I mean, it's like really dark. Okay, I don't know what the point of that is, to be honest. I leave. Maybe I should just go to work. I <laughs> just leave. I'm assuming this closes the game. Okay. I mean, that's, to be honest, uh, you know, I don't, I don't really shower in the morning. I don't have time. I shower at night, you know? Is that weird? I don't think that's weird. Hmm. 
actually i forgot the controls there's controls right maybe there's a way to bring up my inventory <laughs> i totally forgot i remember seeing that uh uh screen of instructions but well let's just turn on the hot tap hot water getting steamy which might indicate something hmm pretty foggy in here i could draw something if i wanted to sure why not uh i draw a line i draw a diagonal line zoop i draw a circle i draw one circle there my reflection is now banned <laughs> okay and draw a triangle uh pointing out hmm fun okay that i don't know if that does anything <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't think that does anything i feel like um unless there's some kind of secret hidden like thing that i can do i don't know oh fall again uh zhang residence uh zhang speaking zhang zhang right zhang uh hi ingrid i must say your phone matter has really improved these past few months even if it's still a tad redundant yeah 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 what do you want um i could use a perspective on something any plumbing tips? To tell the truth, Ingrid, I have no idea what I'm doing. I've never had to plumb my own bathroom before. Why don't you try getting rid of that gunk? What, with a bucket? No, stupid. I'm using the actual drain. Did you know that what's clogging it? Did you leave the plug in? Is there an arm sticking out of the pipe? It's hard to tell just by looking. I'd rather not touch whatever this is. Well, I'm not going to do it for you. Maybe you can knock it loose or something. I don't know. It's your bathroom. Look around. Um... Uh, do you th actually think it's a ghost? <laughs> do, you, do you actually think it's a ghost? Huh? I was just quoting that movie you had playing on the TVs the other day. Roommates or whatever. Why, do you? Mm, I don't know. Most ghost stories are about people who can't see. I can't make a definitive argument over the existence of something or someone so intangible. So it's not worth thinking about. Well, one of them unseen people might be manifesting sludge in your bathroom. And there's a lot of other things that may be causing it too. So rather than argue about the cause, let's focus on fixing the symptoms, okay? I found a rubber duck. Hey Ingrid, guess what I found? Yeah, well, I knew it, you do have a rubber duck collection. It's not mine, it's a friend. You have friends? Anyway, quit being such a killjoy, Miss Eve. Thought that bad boy. Okay. Uh, talk to something else. How's your study going? Ugh, next question. Alright, why'd you leave it to the last second again? Dude, do you know how hard it is trying to get quiet time in this house? The AMs are like the only time I'm not working, then mom is, isn't breathing down my neck. Maybe you're right. Maybe I should have just gone to bed. Don't say that. It's not like a few hours are gonna uh, effing make my enter go up. What? You sure you don't want him to come over? No. No. You're not throwing your grades away just to help me fix the pipe. Okay, okay. Sheesh. So, got any tips for calculating the medium circumference of a teenager's skull? Um, I mean, median means like a central tendency. Usually we use this with statistics, right? Or, uh, I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> I'll get back to you. Just just look it up. Just Google it. Anyway, um, all right. Should go. All right. And then uh, say hi to girls for me. You talk to Ingrid, but that's kind of it. Blood red and very, very goopy. It's nauseating to watch. That's why I couldn't find my jeans. I haven't actually washed them. Okay, you can right click on stuff, by the way. Is this the one I stole from the hotel? It must be. It's far nicer than my others. Bees have seen myself and walked over there. Hmm. Let's turn off the hot water for now. Not really sure what I'm doing, to be honest. Ah, uh, floss more. Rusty strawberry scented bottles. I don't recall if I used any of them more than once. Half full box of adhesive bandages with cartoon builders printed on it. They're on sale. 30 bucks worth and yet barely more than a placebo. Not sure why I bought her. Shoot a little core, shoot a little light. At least one thing works properly. I'll have enough uh, been at this. Still need to open, but. Hmm. Hate those things. They always stick. 
You can never tell when it's, when it's empty, empty vitamins, leftovers when it used to try to be healthy. I don't know, it depends. Vitamins, as far as I know, I mean, you need them if a doctor tells you you need them, like you have a deficiency, but usually it doesn't really matter. I think vitamins are like, you can easily take too much. That's the thing. Better to get it from food. Uh, these catalogs. Let's stop ordering them because no one was taking them. I dumped whole boxes of them. Here we are, four months later. I'm still trying to find them. All, I'm still trying to find them all over my apartment. Okay, so I think, okay, the catalogs. It seems like, uh, from what I can piece together, <laughs> you know, like a detective. Uh, it seems like we own the store, actually. We own this store called Video 9, apparently. I don't know if it's a chain of stores, maybe. We're just one of the managers, but it seems like we do own that store. And, you know, we did some marketing for it, but it's not going well, I guess. I wonder how long your study is going. I don't know. Minty. If no longer fresh, it's mostly empty. Keep it around for emergencies. Ah, my hair feels so oily. I bet it's sticking up right now. It is. Okay. Um, here's the thing. I'm stuck because I totally forgot what the controls are. I I, I should have paid more attention. I, I was too cocky. I was like, ah, whatever. I'll just skip this these controls. I was, I was going on a tangent about something else. I just skipped it. Um, in that case, I guess I'll have to literally look at my own VOD because I totally forgot what the instructions were. It was, it turns out it was the button E. You would think it would be like I or like, I don't know. I was thinking like shift or something. Control. I don't know. But like it's E apparently. What the heck? I wouldn't think of that. E for me anyway, for video games means to interact or to lean right, you know, in the like realistic first person shooter. I can never think of E as the inventory. <laughs> anyway, all right, well. Mm -mm. Okay. So let's press the button E. That opens our inventory. Apparently, you have some stuff. Let's see. You have a broom. I've had many over the years, but this has always been a favorite. So easy to swing. Factory reject candles. Cheap but bright. The wicks poke out from both top and bottom. I can never decide on the side to burn. Cool Ranch the Duck, Joseph's old rubber ducky, a buoyant fellow, I don't know why he called it that. And drain key, uh, cleaner. Just look, uh, just little cuts through a lot. Oh, just a little cuts through a lot. Yeah, we'll see about that. Okay. Um, I guess we can use it on stuff. I use duck on myself. Hi there, duck. Okay, <laughs> we have dialogue with the duck. So you're Cool Ranch. You're the famous Cool Ranch. I'm quite the talk of the computer lab back in the day. Must be nice being a duck. No jobs, no taxes. No comprehension of the way showers are supposed to work. So simple. You know the name of ghosts. You know how to talk to ghosts. Come on, you must have consorted a few dark ones in your life. I'll make you talk one of these days. Uh, I wonder how your owner's doing. He's probably a gajillionaire by now. Hacking mainframes, reticulating splines, whatever that means. Whatever it is coders do when they become British. You think he... Never mind. Okay. We're gonna stop talking to a duck. We're gonna, we're gonna stop being... Crazy. Uh, I activate duck on towel. Activate duck on mirror cabinet. It reflects. I activate duck on cabinet. I'm doing the thing point click adventure games you know, like rub things on other things. Get some dialogue now though, actually. Usually you don't. Usually you get like, oh this doesn't work. This doesn't work. This doesn't work. You know, whatever, but you actually get extra dialogue. And now it smells like strawberries. Oh. Not gonna fit in there, or vice versa. Maybe I wrap this thing in the magazine. No, that won't work. I don't think Ingrid needs to hear about every little thing I keep in my bathroom. Clean the duck with toothpaste. Now it smells like mint. Amazing. Okay, this doesn't do anything. Um, alright. Well, let's stop playing around. I guess, uh, let's see. They did mention they'll use the duck on the bathtub, apparently. Good. It's in the bathtub now. I don't know how that helps, to be honest. This would be cuter if it wasn't floating in blood. Hi there, duck. Oh, I can talk to it some more, but I already did. Okay. 
Th uh, when I right click on stuff, you know, she can observe stuff, but um, seems like Clar Clarissa just smiles, you know, when you look at the duck, apparently. It's just, you know, duck is just that chariz charismatic. Um, all right. Well, there's a broom. I use broom on myself. Two be things on the rug is what I do pass. Not as big enough as it is. Um, it reflects. <laughs> Not ever. Okay. okay. Uh, what if I use broom on on this? Hulk of the drain. Huh. There's something squishy in the drain. An organic buildup, perhaps. Hmm. Ew. <laughs> you know, like ew. What does that mean, though? I don't know. Hmm. Rain clean. You just put it in there? I don't think that helps. That's everything in the bottle. I hope I didn't just make chlorine gas. At least that will loosen up whatever's in the drain. Okay, let's poke it again, maybe. Huh. The blockage seems to be gone, but nothing is draining. What am I missing? Hmm. Hmm. I have this. I don't know what you would use this for. I know, like, a way to... No, I can put it here, apparently. Now where those matches get? To? Yeah, I was wondering, like, I don't know if there's any way to... Yeah, I don't know if there's any way to... Uh, light it up. That's what I'm trying to say. Haunting Miranda Manor. I was wondering, actually, you could draw something on the mirror. You could focus on this, actually. A big circle, triangle to the left, three lines. Can I do something like that? Would that do anything? <laughs> you know, why would he? Why would you do a strange ritual like that? I guess we can try doing that for no reason. Sure. Let's draw three horizontal lines. One, two, three. Draw one circle smooth and inoffensive and draw a triangle pointing to the left add a bit of that hmm i don't think of it this looks like the seance sig sigil they use in the random manor movie of course nothing's happening it's all a load of nonsense unless i missed a step whatever i'll let the steam clean this up hmm okay so you can do that for some reason <laughs> you know kind of like working on the theory that we're haunted um but i don't know that how much that helps Maybe I should just go to work. Yeah, what happens if I just leave, by the way? No, oh, we're just gonna leave. Well, this is a problem for a plumber. Or a priest. Whichever won't ask questions. Later that day. Ah, my hair feels disgusting. <laughs> Didn't take a shower. Uh, here's a plumber. With amazing hair, by the way. Excuse me, I'm looking for the owner. Hmm? I got a call about a blocked pipe. Oh, yeah, right. The bathroom's upstairs. Door's over there. Now, at least I got here quickly. This is gonna cost a fortune. Oh, shit. Okay. I guess the plumber died. Whoops. Well. And turn off the lights. Which is a thing you can do, I guess. Oh, what the? That's strange. Ducky? Are you down there, buddy? Where did it go? I can't see the bottom of the lights off. Oh, <laughs> what the heck? That's... That was strange. <laughs> also, like, I don't know. I don't know how you would know to do that, by the way. That was some, like, definitely some point-and-click logic. Apparently, you put the duck in the bathtub and turn off the lights? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Turn off the water. What is this? There's definitely something in there. It's got to wiggle it loose, and... It's a duck. I didn't think it was that flexible. Doesn't matter. Glad to have you back. Hold on. Something's tied to its base with... Is that yarn? Box of matches? How do those get down here? 
all right there you go okay it was i don't know how very strange that you have to do that in order to i was also having the water running i don't know if that affects it but that was strange uh it's drenched in red and lacking the glint in its eyes what have you seen cool ranch and also an ordinary pack of matches now it's like my drain pipe for some reason isn't that weird Mm. Sorry for almost sacrificing you to the bath gods. Dark bath gods. You look more bloodproof than you actually were. No. It will happen again. Okay. Do you put the duck back in the thing? Apparently. There you go. This would be cuter if it wasn't floating in blood. There you go. Um, okay. I think I guess we were supposed to do that. The game again, I guess. Anything else we can talk to with Ingrid, by the way? I'll double check. Me again, figured. Uh, there's no make like make the ring quieter. I don't want mom to think I'm selling meth again. That raises several questions. Her logic is real weird and only gets worse when she hasn't slept right. Hm. Try covering it with a pillow. Will do. Anyway, what's up? Hmm. So my sink exploded. <laughs> you know, by the way. Wow. You know, now that you mention it, I've heard about stuff like that happening. After water gets turned off or clogged for a while, there's like air bubbles in the pipes. So when you flip it on again, the faucet is all... <laughs> Just be careful turning things off and on, I guess. Make sure there's nothing down there first. Hmm. Okay. Got it. apparently that's the thing you know i don't know i i criticize it as point click adventure logic but maybe that's actually a thing i never knew that though i guess i'm not a plumber i'm not you know mario i didn't know that apparently that can happen where like if you I guess have like air bubbles in the pipes it can make the other sources of water burst out of the drain i don't know i didn't know that could happen um hmm. well, anyway so, I guess the next step we can do, I guess, is use the matches on the candles. Like so. There. Alrighty. Need them for now. I like the ambience they give off. Alright, so let's do the thing. Let's see. Uh, I don't know if I need to put the, the duck back there, but let's do that anyway. Let's do the thing here. So we're going to draw the Saiyan, say, uh, Saiyan symbol that we saw in the uh, catalog. One circle, draw a triangle, and then do the left, add a bit of that. There. One tacky Saiyan sigil from one tacky movie. Am I really so desperate for a shower? I'm trying this. Whatever. I'll let the steam clean this up. Oh. What's this? Return. I did not write that. I'm certain I did not write that. Turn. There's writing in the steam. Of course there's writing in the bloody steam. Where is it pointing to? The laundry? If there's nothing in the pockets, then... There's something down the back of the cabinet. Okay, back of sink pipe. What is that? Some kind of rock? I don't want any jewelry like that. A previous tenant, maybe. Let's take a look. It's an amber necklace. At least I think it's amber. What's it doing in my bathroom? Have I never cleaned down the back of the sink? And if there's really is something in the tub, I wants this thing. Okay. Well, let's try off the app for now. Also, call my friend again. Just keep, like, annoying her when she's trying to study for exam, by the way. Hi, Ingrid. Got some... Dude, you're echoing a lot. Is there something wrong with the... Wait. You keep your landline in the bathroom? Shut up. You need to relax more. Anyway, what happened this time? 
I, I was wondering about that. Yeah, why do you keep the phone in the in the bathroom? I don't know. Hey. Um I think the dead are talking to me. Ingrid, um the mirror, it Misty. I saw uh, forget it. Do you, you sound real freak. Tell me. No. No, it's, it's it's fine. I'm just tired and angry and imagining shit. That's got to be a prank. It's probably a prank by her. Not hard to fake mirror writing. All it takes is a bit of grease to block condensation and whatever the punchline this bullshit is, I'm sure I'll find it near that arrow. Okay, then. Glad you called to tell me nothing. Super cool of you. <laughs> okay. Okay, it seems like, yeah, Ingrid is kind of basically our hint system. I also just want to talk to her, just for dialogue, but... Uh, I also think what I found with the ghost wants. Ingrid, I'm going to ask you something in complete seriousness, and I need you to answer seriously, too. Okay. Weirdly intense, but what's up? Have you at any point over the past week used the upstairs bathroom? What? No. You're positive? Because if this is a setup to another joke... Dude, I told you like five times. The store bathroom is nasty, and your apartment's no better. I used the Git Fits bathroom. And you never snuck up there for any other purpose or hidden anything behind any of my cabinets. No? Oh man, you found something, didn't you? Yeah, it looks like an amber pendant. Rad. As a praying mantis inside. Still rad. And I think... I think the thing in the tub... You screwing with me? Are you screwing with me? Misty, you're my boss and capable of financially wrecking my shit if you wanted to. So... No, so, no I say this with that in mind. Throw that thing in the dumpster and find some place else to piss. Okay? Alright. Never mind. Exercise safe! Alright. Okay, so we have the necklace this time. What do we just leave with the necklace, actually? So, okay, so what happens... All right. This is getting weird, really weird. Someone's probably screwing with me, but is it worth sticking around to find out? Yeah, let's just go. You know, there's totally nothing mysterious about this random necklace that we found in our bathroom. Don't worry about it. It's not cursed. Let's just leave. Yeah, screw this. Three days later. Ah, what a week. What am I gonna do? Can't keep relying on the gym showers. Ah, maybe I'm overreacting. Maybe I should call a plumber. You should call a priest. Yo, Miss D? Mm hmm? So I know you wanted me to restock, but uh, I think there might be something wrong with that last delivery. What now? Well, I mean, all the water in the fridge is kind of... It's gone all... Ask her, just look. H2O. Uh oh. Okay, so. <laughs> it's funny how the, everything turned red, but I guess that that implies that uh, we got cursed, I guess, and everything turned into water. Or turned to blood, rather. All the water turned to blood. <laughs> okay. I guess we have this pendant. Necklace? A chunk of amber with something inside, tied to a string. Is this what the ghost wants? Just holding this thing is giving me a bad feeling. I'd rather not put it on and be possessed by a demon. Alright, fine. Let's put it in the bathtub. This is what you're after, isn't it? This necklace, and then you'll leave me alone? Sure, let's drop it in. Fine. Have it. Now will you please get on my tub? Nothing? Nothing at all? Great. Super. Can't believe I let Ingrid talk me into believing complete horseshit. Nothing left to do but go to work, I guess. <laughs> I guess that is that it? Stupid, stupid, stupid. I bet that ugly thing was made out of plastic. And the wall is probably rancid shampoo and food dye. This is what I get for hiring a bunch of nerds. <laughs> okay. This is a prank. A complete joke and an absolute waste of my time. 
Hmm. What if I hit the light switch again? Same thing as before, right? Whoop. Oh. Uh. Hello. <laughs> so, oh, okay. You've reached Video 9's answering machine. Business hours are between 8 a.m. and 11 p.m. Please leave a message and one of our friendly staff will... Miss Dunce? Or Dunce? dunce? <laughs> no, it, sounds, it sounds like Dunce as in Dunce Cap or something. I don't know. I don't know if you pronounce that. Anyway, it's me. You weren't answering, so I... Look, I'm coming in. Please have pants on. Yeah, sounds like a sewer in here. Where the hell's the? Ah. Okay. Okay, that's Ingrid. Ingrid came over. Oh man, this does wasn't wasn't kidding. That seriously looks like blood. Is this a prank? No, she... Oh, man, what if she actually hurt herself? Should I call the cops? Uh, can we get some help in here, please? <laughs> okay. She's still alive, or...? Alright, well... I don't know. That reminds me of Junji Ito, by the way. Alright, there you go. I guess that's all the endings. Um, I didn't know there were actually like uh, uh, secret endings, or not really secret, but you know, the extra little uh, dialogue if you quit at certain points. Probably edit that for YouTube, but there you go. That's all the endings. Um, but yeah, don't know what happened at the end there. In the canonical one, you know, I guess we got captured by the ghosts, <laughs> and then we were in the pipes and everything. That actually is pretty scary. I, I'm not sure. It's left ambiguous. You know, she was just, you know, she was just asking for help. So I was just wondering if that was meant to be funny, you know, it's like actually she's fine and she's just stuck in the pipes. Or is it that she's actually become one of the ghosts and she's like a weird pipe ghost as well. And like, she's about to kill Ingrid or something, you know, I don't know. I'm not sure. But uh, that was pretty good. You know, the, the animation is pretty good. I like the art style. It's kind of retro and everything. Uh, the point and click stuff was also not too bad, you know. The one thing I got like stuck on was definitely the uh, the light switch. You know, the light switch I didn't know was a trigger, you know, for like two parts of the puzzle actually, for two parts of the, of the progression. So I feel like that was a bit of point and click logic, you know, that always like like weird logic which doesn't make sense to me in any way. Uh, oh, I didn't see your comment, x -Pan. Uh You said, does anything happen if you throw in in the water and leave without something light? Yeah, I tried that actually. So, you know, I probably won't put this on YouTube. But so basically, if you try to leave um, after putting the necklace in the tub, uh, then the character will say uh, she can't leave until she turns off the light. So you're kind of stuck at that ending if uh, you try to leave after putting it in the bathtub. So there's no way to survive, it seems like. You know, it just ends horribly. <laughs> but anyway. Um, yeah, it looks like the things, the fights with friends we made along the way. Amazing. But there you go. Um, yeah. As it turns out, it was kind of like, it, it was a horror game, you know? It, it depends how you interpret that last part, I guess, you know? I'm not sure, <laughs> you know? It, it definitely reminds me, I think I already said this, but it definitely reminds me of that Junji Ito story about someone being stuck in the pipes. Um, it's just kind of horrific, actually. I don't think the game, you know, it could, they could have went the more Junji Ito where you show, you know, someone being mutilated inside the pipes, but... I guess they didn't do that. Anyway, yeah, as I said before, uh, very well made game, actually. You know, I would say that, yeah, the animation's really good. You know, it's, it's interesting how the animations are just kind of good. I mean, you know, it's kind of like um, high quality for like a point of adventure game, you know? Um, yeah. It kind of flows well. There's a lot of like cool flavor text, actually. I found like there's definitely a lot more optional stuff, you know? I didn't, I don't think I did at all, but, you know, just little things 
Um, you can just like rub items on other items and like you know see a lot a lot of flavor text in this game actually a lot of optional text, uh, which is pretty cool. You know, if there's one thing I do like about you know, point click games is actually you know the the amount of like just I don't know I don't know how to describe it, but like uh just like stuff you know that the, your character says or observes about the world um that i do like about point click adventure games the only thing i don't like is obviously when the puzzles get too <laughs> hard and like illogical to me anyway but again not too bad for this one um yeah well you know uh, i mean there's anything else um i mean i don't know i i think uh it's just a pretty well made kind of like uh you know, short little story about blood in your shower, I guess. You know? Or blood in your bathtub, really. I guess you take, I mean, you took a shower in the bathtub, I guess. But, uh, I didn't actually, like, see a shower head, you know? She, met, she mentioned, like, a shower, like, taking a shower. I didn't see, like, a shower head. You know, anything to do, you know, like, actually turning on the shower. Surprised that we didn't actually do that, you know? Um, but, yeah. And I guess, I mean, I guess that's it for... There's something in the pipes. Um, I guess if you're on YouTube, you didn't know, I stream these games live on Twitch, so check me out over there if you're interested. I also have other playthroughs on the channel, so you can look for those if you want. Thanks for watching. Until next time, see you then.